<laughs> Hello, everybody. We're having a little camera trouble. Give us half a second. So go ahead and do the intro, Is Okay. <laughs> hey, everyone. <laughs> Welcome back to Meyer Studio Sketch Club. My name is Izzy. Next to me is my dad, Jason. And just behind us is my mom, Cindy. Tonight, we will work again 10 minutes on both of the sketches that we started. Sunday night, just a reminder, we're not having any sketch club on Thursday since it is Christmas Eve. Before we get started, my dad will take a few minutes to go on the iPad and talk about how he came to his sketches before we get started on, uh, before we get started at 7. Oh, we're back. Hi. Hey. Hi. 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 <laughs> Surprise. See, we were just seeing if you guys were paying attention. <laughs> All right. <laughs> So welcome everybody. Uh, no. Oh my goodness, what is happening? We're having some technical problems. Let's try one more time. And you know we got this on video, so there's no need for. You know what? Let's just scroll right to the iPad and keep <laughs> on rolling. Here we go. All right. So we're gonna draw eyes tonight, and this is all about form. And what do I mean about by form? Well, it's literally the three dimensions, like that rolling under, and then the eyelid, and then dropping down to the eyeball, over the eye, out onto the eyelid, down, up, and over, up, turn, turn. You see that as we make, the, make our way across across and it goes so if we were an ant traversing here we would be doing something like that so that's what you're gonna see uh, me going after tonight and let's just see if we can give you a little example of what will happen so you're gonna see a we need a little bit of an edge here So if the shadow comes like that, then what can I do next to the shadow? Well, I could stick a lot, right? And so what that tells you is it go, says, we go from this direction and now we're changing directions. Okay, so you can watch for that tonight. And if it makes sense, you can use it or if you're doing a different uh, approach. But again, if we can get that three dimensionality, that three dimensionality. So in other words, we got a front plane and then that's turning around and that's turning around, right? So we wanna see that big form way before we start seeing these little bitty forms, right? Look how much bigger this is right this change is how much bigger than right this is much steeper much steeper hi karen okay do you want me to help him are we back we're back we we're are. back well you can hear our voice you can hear our voice hey it's miss darlene peterson do you guys see this yay hi darlene uh, well we miss your eyes so we yeah Slow down, we'll be here. We'll get oh. You know, things get crazy sometimes. Alright, so I'm gonna leave the lecture right there. We are gonna jump right into Sketch Club since we don't have a camera. We just won't even act like we do. You guys <laughs> You guys uh got your stuff and ready to go? Good evening, Susan made it. Hi. Alright. Hi mom. Coming back to our camera. Who needs cameras? When you got personalities like this, shh, cameras. <laughs> so why don't we take this pretty picture off? <laughs> And that'll give us room to move this down a little bit. <laughs> Let's see, and that's the, that's, uh, what's the wrong eyes? You'll be, that's tonight is going eyes. wonderfully. There we go. 
There we go. So I only work on that one eye. So the first thing I did, I think if you remember last time I mentioned the um, nose was too long. So we just went ahead and took that right out. Now what you're going to see me here do is kind of develop a darker to go for my gray and then grab a couple of hard edges while, while I'm at it. All right, it's amazing how much a hard edge can do in the appropriate spot. All right, you can take all that kind of muddle of that rubbed charcoal and just boom, bring it into focus immediately. So we got a nice email saying that uh, some of the people who have been watching us and are sketching are really improving. It made me very happy. So mm -hmm. glad you guys are having a good time and doing It's always fun to sketch. It's kind of like learning a new language. Even if you're not planning on being an artist or something, it's a little bit different way of thinking. And the more ways you can think, the better, in my opinion more problems you can solve so <clears throat> this is the very first <laughs> ever video recorded under our brand new installed oh. <laughs> lights so I hope you enjoy it I haven't got the camera set back up, but we set this up for Sketch Club, but we got our new lights installed, and uh, I think it's gonna be awesome. So it we got- It's very fun to play with, but <laughs> very heavy. <laughs> it's a big light, but I think it's gonna do the job for us. So we're gonna have to rearrange some cameras and then check it out. So that's the plan for tomorrow, camera rearrangement. I feel like I'm adding a bandit's mask. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's the two-dimensional versus three dimensions. Just keep going. You'll get it. Again, don't worry, especially as you start with it being like exactly right or beautiful. Just keep sketching, you know. Come back and see how it's going and keep going. Hey. Hello, Miss Shakti. Ellie, right? Hi. Ella or Ella or Ellie? I think oh my gosh. one of two. Sorry, I think maybe Ellie. Anyway, it's welcome. something. We just ate, so we're a little food coma. <laughs> welcome, welcome. We were just saying we got our our new light up, and it's uh, awesome. Heavy it's but awesome. awesome. Heavy but awesome. So what are you doing here with that kind of hard line there? is that tells you we're ending the form of the nose and then we can drop down into the eye socket but a hard edge helps start or end a form and sometimes if it's complex forms the hard edge won't see into the form but it may see into the cast shadow from the form if that doesn't make any sense don't worry about it <laughs> don't worry about it so we got a pl uh, we found a platform where they can host our classes. So we'll have a free charcoal class on form, hopefully within the month of January. I'm really hoping before January, but let's give ourselves a little elbow room. And that will be all about form. When the class is over, you will know how to draw a cube a sphere, a cylinder, a cone, and a cup. And with those forms, you can build anything. Anything? Anything. <laughs> wow. Mm -hmm. So, that'll be the first course we build, and we're gonna offer that uh, up for free, and hope you guys will check it out and give us a little feedback. What's up? What the heck was that? 
Your voice just like a bit dropped, and you were talking very soft, and it was. Really I'm an artist. Dainty. I was an artist. And I had a mood change. Wow. <clears throat> Are you feeling okay? Yeah, I just, I just roll with it. <laughs> I don't fight it. I just roll with it. Well, this isn't awful. Well, that's good. So there's lots of subtle form of the nose. As you can see, like the ball of the nose, and then you have the wings of the nose. So that's what I mean by complex form. It's not like a simple cylinder, <clears throat> but it may be a cylinder on one part and more squarish on another part. So those forms don't necessarily have to stay true all the way th through. But do you see how I'm trying to build that three dimensionality there? really have those forms come off the paper. And don't forget about your other tools, because here I'm shading the eyeball with the stump by just dragging some of the charcoal that's already down there. But that keeps me from being too heavy-handed. And it keeps, it also feels a little more eyeball-like, if, if you'll allow me. If you'll allow me. It's not awful. That's awesome. Izzy's drawing drawing the other eye on this eye that you're looking at right now. <laughs> so that's kind of fun. <laughs> Don't freeze up on us video. That's kind of fun. Everything's good. Everything's good. We're just rolling along. <laughs> you sound so chill. Oh, well. Am I usually pretty stressed out? No, but you at least have energy. Today you sound like one of those like sleeping videos. Oh. Tonight, folks, we're taking a journey into a land far, far away. Oh. <laughs> 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 uh, I love you so much. <laughs> Your on-air critiques are the best. <laughs> I apologize for my low energy <laughs> or my romantic voice or my fireside <laughs> chat, whatever <laughs> whatever Izzy's calling me out for. But I did have a dental appointment and uh, so Wait, two years ago. So that was yesterday. That was yesterday? <gasps> Wait, that was yesterday? Yes. That felt like two weeks ago. <laughs> so I'm great with time as you can tell. You are great. You are great, great, great. I said with time, not in roll. <laughs> Why are you yelling at the people? Because. <laughs> All right. So just to update everybody on our schedule this week, will be the last sketch club this week. We'll take Thursday evening off. I know we're such slackers, but we're going to do it anyway. And we'll return Sunday and then for YouTube, we live Wednesday and Thursday morning for student feedback. And then we'll be live tonight at 8 and tomorrow night at 8 for Masterworks. And then we'll come back to that schedule Monday. Um, for those of you not aware of it, the midday show, studio time at 1.30 was canceled for this week so that we could uh, get our new lights installed. And now that we have that up, we have to uh, rearrange the, the cameras. Rearrange the cameras. <laughs> so we're taking. Uh, we canceled that show this week so that we could get oh. that stuff taken care of, and hopefully next week we can unveil it to you guys. Oh. What's going on? It's nerve wracking thinking I'm gonna have to move a pole with three cameras on it. No. <laughs> <laughs> it ain't no thing. Oh, but it is something. It ain't no thing. Why did that sound like the monkey from The Lion King? <laughs> oh, what's his name? Uh, uh, Julian. No, 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 no. The one from The Lion King is Timon and Pumbaa. No, Sorry, no the I... monkey. Rafiki. Yeah, the dude that hits him with the pole and he's like, yes, the past can hurt. <laughs> <laughs> but you can either learn from it or run from it. Uh, and then he swings at him again. I want him, all, I want him all to be King Julian, I think. <laughs> wow, that would be chaos. <laughs> <laughs> okay.
Okay, again, so you see how I'm working on these forms. And again, 10 minutes is not a long time. And so this is be a total of 20 minutes at the end of this 10 minute session, which it looks like we're getting pretty close to. Oh, yeah, so that's as far as I got tonight. So I'll do another 10 minutes on the child's eyes. And if you weren't here Sunday, just start over. This was our first 10 minutes. I kind of like this. Yeah, it looks really good. I think it's cool too. It's fun having you work on drawings with me. And this one too, I, I think the nose was long, but I don't think this got wiped out until a little later in the process. We'll just have to wait and see. Have to wait and see. Why don't you try to start over here and do another study over there? Uh, Are you gonna try to improve my drawing? I'm gonna improve your drawing. You're gonna improve I my drawing. I see many flaws. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, <laughs> rude. So, you guys having much luck with eyes? I'd like to hear. Um, I, I don't want to say anything, but I'd like to hear. Eyes, they're not easy. But they're, they're not super difficult. They're not easy in three dimensions. All right, keeping track of all that coming and going. Or are you guys just knocking it out? They go and knock it out. Sketching like crazy, I bet. Nice. Last week was fun. Don't delete people. That was a Sunday. We're not super glitchy. Wow. Let's see. Let's see here. How there. brave are we feeling? Not very brave. How brave are we feeling? Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. No. Um, but what are we doing? <laughs> I don't know I don't what you're know. doing. Mm. <laughs> you could do the, you can go this down, you can, right you can go down, and you can do the little plus thing, remember? Hey, there we are. Hi. Hello. Man, it feels good not to be a disembodied voice. <laughs> I liked being a disembodied voice. That's the difference between me and you. All right, let's see. You like being seen. Yep. I do not. I'm a man of the world, you know that. <laughs> <laughs> the indoor cat of the world. Yeah, for those not in on the inside joke, I am a hermit. <laughs> I think it's safe to say. <laughs> I call you my indoor cat. Yes, I'm Izzy's indoor cat, as she likes to say. <laughs> yeah, in my 30s, I developed some pretty severe outdoor allergies. So, and then being in kind of what are we calling this home? Stay at home orders or whatever, yeah. and really not going out. I'm and not going out for days at a time and even weeks at a time. My allergies got markedly better, and so it is improving. We are going to go hiking tomorrow, and it is all going to be good. <laughs> it is true. I'm going to venture out for a evening hike with Isabella tomorrow. I'm making him hike Madonna Mountain to the sunset. We're going to hike up at the sunset and see the tree light up Tree light up before the permits are required. <laughs> and we're going to be down and gone before uh, the authorities arrive. <laughs> that sounds so wrong. <laughs> <laughs> <That's> so bad. <laughs> well, we're artists. We're rebels. That's right. <laughs> you know me. Jason, fancy pants danger. <laughs> that was my name. <laughs> <laughs> to what? What's that? To what? This is what everybody called me. Who are they? You know. I don't! <laughs> <laughs> Let me have a little imagination. I'm just playing with my imagination. Are you sketching this one? I am focusing on the camera and how it's working. <laughs> <laughs> and I am enjoying that sense of life. Oops. What no? Oh uh, well, this may be why we're doing here, because <laughs> yep. it's us. Everything's wanting to update, so I bet that update fixes our little glitch there. Yes. So we'll do that later. Oh, the nose is gone. Vanished. I wonder um. if it'll come back. Oh, <laughs> I have no idea. We'll have to wait and see. 
And again, sometimes during the process, you'll, you might lose some things, but that's okay. That's okay. It's all about learning and watch how once you know, you know about the hard and soft and moving things around, it's just a matter of some push and pull and you're going to be surprised at how everything comes together, especially at the end on this one. So we're about halfway through on this one. All right, so when you finish sketching tonight, I would like to know if you found this week too difficult or if you like some of the different things we're drawing. Let me know because we will take that in consideration when I'm picking out content and things like that. Like always, if you think you have some photographs that'll be fun to sketch from, please send them in. And I can't promise that they'll make it. But if I feel like we can get some good sketches from them, and I can teach something from it, then we use them. Mm -hmm. My opinion is I found this fun, but I do enjoy. I prefer the five minutes and then 10, 10. Yeah. That yeah. for me works better because then I can work on all the drawings. Yeah. Yeah, I think we'll probably go back to that format it, unless we're doing complex material. The eye is such kind of a complex thing, you unless must, you have a lot of experience. You must do 10 on each. Five minutes is just not very much time. At all. They're going to draw a circle with a circle. <laughs> circle, circle, dot, dot. Now we got our cootie shot. What? Don't tell me you don't, you've never heard that. No, no. What? No. <laughs> I've, you got to be kidding me. From childhood, you never heard circle, circle, dot, dot. Now you have your cootie shot. No. <laughs> I've heard something similar. Line, line, number nine. Spiders crawling up your spine. Dot, dot, electric shot. Okay. But I've never, I've never heard, heard either of those. I only know it because my friends used to do it to me, and I did not like spiders, and I'd always think there was a spider <laughs> on my back, and I'd just start, like, running. Because you have to do, like, this thingy, and I'm like, hmm. You see how I just push the eye, that black of the eye, a little bit bigger? That's the advantage of working like this. When you're not getting your cootie shot, I guess. Mom commented. What? She's never heard it either. Really? Where? Oh, why didn't you show your comment? I wonder if that's a southern thing or a Texas thing or it something. It might be a Texas thing. That's what I, I just assumed everybody always heard that. Oh, assumptions. Assumptions, assumptions. Nope, not me either. Stop it. Stop it. You guys are just trying to make me paranoid. Stop it. Get some help. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and notice how the black and the white and the heavier is... Even though when it's not a lot of definition, you're still drawn to that area because of the bigger value changes. And as things get defined just a little bit, you're going to be drawn even more to that area versus all the gray versus all the gray well it's kind of cool because when it's like a lighter dark it brings it to life but in a sense of vagueness and this like whoa. yeah it's like a soft release yeah right so like a little kiss on the forehead and bye I love you versus being dropped out of a flying airplane <laughs> right, Wait, it's a softer they, release do they have parachutes <laughs> <laughs> that's yeah. his first question that is first question <laughs> well that question is a little late at this point <laughs> <laughs> after you're halfway out did i remember <laughs> mm -hmm. right and so kind of the spacing this is such a fun game I, to me it's a fun game just that three dimension right so that line doesn't really l look so we're not working in line, but working in mass. And what those two lines represents, that underplane of the nose, that turning under. And then there's a side plane that's also kind of a semicircle there. Right? And then there's a cast shadow down the lip. And look how that just cast shadow defined that whole lower part of the face. So it's, it's a language and it can be learned like anything else. 
but the exact how much and where and the aesthetic balance, that's the poetry. That's the poetry. The rhyme and the rhythm, how hard you grab them, how soft you let them go. What? Visually. Oh. Visually. <laughs> I had confusion. Expand that imagination. Yeah, these are notes, man. They're oh, notes. Noses back. They're notes. They're nothing but notes, cat. Who was cat? It's a jazz musician reference. Oh, okay. Man, I cannot talk to you about the Greek gods, <laughs> about jazz history. I mean, how am, how am I supposed to relate to you? Right? Philosophy, right? Advanced oil painting techniques. How are you and I supposed to get along if you don't, like, give me something? Because we can both be very immature. <laughs> <laughs> and it clicks. <laughs> oh, the, the immaturity is where we meet. I love it. All right. All right. That's someplace. I'll take it. That's someplace. <laughs> Hey, was that the end of our video? I think that so. Was the end. The end of our video. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, should we see a quick rewind? Yes. Let's see, see a quick rewind, and then I want to hear how you guys did and what you think about the more complex to the simple, simpler drawings. I didn't do this one, but I think the other one turned out pretty good. I do too. We did a good job on that. Mm -hmm. Again, the first thing I did here was just erase that nose because it was too long and readjust it. It's not a big, again, but you just have to see how much time you have. On these, we don't have a lot of time. So even if the dimensions are a little bit off, you you keep going. What are you giggling about, kiddo? Because I, I accidentally spun your little thing, and I thought that it was the thing that cranks it, and I uh -oh. immediately just had this panic of the dust going. <laughs> no. We're all good. We're all good. <sighs> the camera's frozen again. Remember to like the video. I can beat. I lost it. Ah. <laughs> Did we come back? Uh, we came back. Yay! Yay! <laughs> Why is my nose so red? All right. Thank you guys so much. Glad you had fun. Uh, we hope you have a happy holidays if we don't see you. We hope to see all you guys on Facebook. But if not... Have a very happy few days. Thank you for all the love. And what else we got here? Anything? We don't have Sketch Club next Thursday. For anybody this who came Thursday. in late. Oh, this Thursday. Yeah, no Sketch Club easy. Thursday. We'll be we'll back have, on Sunday. We'll have morning feedback tomorrow, which is Wednesday and Thursday morning. And we'll have Masterworks tonight at 8 p.m. and tomorrow at 8 p.m. on our YouTube channel. Ah, oh, happy holidays. It's so fun. Thank, thank you, you, thank Shelby. you, thank you. Merry Christmas. All right. Bye, guys. Bye.